Hello and welcome to this How Tech video tutorial. In this video, we're going to be showing you how to create basic formulas in Excel. So I'll just go ahead and delete those formulas and start over. And we can type here in the formula bar, or we can type directly in the cell here. And formulas start with an equal sign. That tells Excel that you're going to be typing in a formula. So I'm going to take this cell here. We can either type in the cell name, or we can just select a cell. And I'll hit the asterisk key and multiply that by this cell. And then I can hit enter, and Excel will do those calculations for me. So there's C3, I can change that to 2, I can type in whatever I want in there, or I can select a cell. So in our next cell here, if I wanted to, I can add a sum. One of Excel's default functions, I can take that row and I can have my answer, or I can go ahead and maybe just change our selection here, change the numbers that it's adding. I can give it that entire range, and I can get that as an answer if I wanted. But what I want for this cell is I want it equal to C12 minus C5. And you can see there I typed in the cell names and did not click them. So here, I want C13 divided by C5. And then I want to multiply that by 100 to get a percentage. So this operator will be done before this operation. Of course, because that's just in order. If I wanted it, let's see if I had an actual plus sign here. Then to get the addition to be done first, I would need to put parentheses between the addition. So a parenthesis right here and one right there. And that will do the addition operation before the multiplication option, which is what I would want. But I'll keep that as a division symbol. And we'll go on to the last cell here. And I want this equal to C13 plus C4. And I'll hit enter and we have our answer. And here's my total dividend. You can see in the formula bar that I have the sum of this whole row right there. This has been a How Tech video tutorial. Please like, subscribe, comment, and thank you for watching.